Greetings everyone. In this video, we'll be looking at uh, NC level 3 probability distributions achievement standard at an excellence level. And in this video, I'll be focusing on using a graphics calculator to solve uh, an inverse uh, triangular distribution problem. This video is second part to the previous video. If you haven't already, please do check that one out. So in this question it says Jack Enju is watching YouTube videos and has done some research on uh, the length of advertisements shown at the beginning of a YouTube video. It can be modeled by a random variable that takes on values between 4 seconds and 45 seconds. The most likely length of advertisement is 17 seconds. Using an appropriate probability distribution model, uh, the first question says uh, calculate the probability that two randomly selected advertisements are both uh, longer than 35 seconds. I've already done this uh, question in my previous video. If you haven't already, please do check that one out. And in this video, I'll do part two of this problem. It says uh, Jack wants to use this information to find the median. And the question says calculate the median length of the advertisement. So in this case, we're given three parameters, uh, minimum value of four seconds, maximum uh, 45 seconds, and the uh, most common value of uh, 17 seconds. Uh, we asked to find the median and we know that median will capture 50%. So this will give uh, us the um, area that uh, is already given, which is 0 0.5. So we already given the probability of 0 0.5. We asked to find the uh, X value. So we'll quickly label the diagram with the information uh, given. So we've got uh, random variable x, which is the length of the advertisement. Then uh, f of x is the probability density function. Uh, the a value is uh, 4 seconds, the minimum. The maximum value b is uh, 45 seconds. And most likely c value is uh, 17 seconds. And then we are asked to find the uh, median, which will capture 50%. Uh, so the area will be 0 0.5 and we can uh, find the x value to determine that the height is given by 2 over b minus a and the height of the triangle the smaller triangle is h dash so we'll substitute um, the uh, information given to find the uh, height of the um, bigger triangle so the height is given by 2 over b minus a and b is 45 a is um, so uh, that simplifies to 2 over 41, which is 0 0.0488. And then we'll use uh, similar triangles to find the uh, height of the smaller triangle, uh, which has an area of uh, 0 0.5. So uh, you can either use uh, similar triangles or f of x formula. Uh, f of x formula is given in your assessment, so you can uh, use that. Uh, but in this video, I'll show you how to use uh, similar triangles because uh, it's pretty straightforward. So you just need to set up your equation. So h dash, so height of the smaller triangle, which is h dash, divided by the base of the smaller triangle, which is b minus x, should be equal to the height of the bigger triangle, which is h, divided by the base of the bigger triangle, which is given by b minus c so once i've got that information i can start substituting so h dash is equal to 45 minus x and this x is unknown this x will be our median value is equal to uh, h which is the height of the bigger triangle and we have already calculated the value so easy to substitute 0 0.0488 divided by the uh, values b minus c so b is 45 so 45 take away c value which is 17 so once i've done that this simplifies to h dash so we take 45 minus x on the other side because we are finding the value for h dash so that is equal to 0 0.0488 times 45 minus x it's divided on this side i'll take it on the other side and multiply so times that whole things divided by 28 the difference between 45 and 17 now i can simplify this uh, here because these are just the numbers there 0.0488 divided by 28 simplifies to 0 0.00174 into uh, 45 minus x now this is the h dash which is the height of the uh, smaller triangle then uh, using the area which is 0 0.5 for the median because median captures 50 percent and the area is given by half the base times height and in this case area is 0 0.5 so 0 0.5 is equal to half 
the base so base of this triangle here is 45 minus x so 45 minus x times the height of this triangle here and the height of the triangle is we calculated earlier we just substituted here so 0 0.00174 times 45 minus x now i can get rid of this half by multiplying both sides by 2 so very easy to do that so 0 0.5 times 2 will give you 1 so 1 is equal to 45 minus x times 0 0.00174 times 45 minus x so i can quickly rearrange uh, this is a constant here i can move it in front uh, not uh, required though you can still use equation solver and uh, solve it from there but um, it's easier to uh, do it this way so 1 is equal to 0 0.00174 times 45 minus x into 45 minus x i don't have to expand and simplify and uh, what have you we'll just uh, grab a graphics calculator uh, go to equation solver and then uh, from the i'll show you how to uh, solve this pretty straightforward from main menu go to uh, equation equations and then uh, you've got three options in this case we'll go equation solver so press f3 and then uh, you type the equation that uh, you want to solve so in this case it was uh, one is equal to so one and then you go shift uh, point which is equal sign so one is equal to uh, 0 0.00174 times uh, we had uh, 45 minus x so 45 take away x theta t please note that x theta t is uh, the unknown variable on graphics calculator so 45 minus x into uh, 45 take away x theta t and then you close the bracket and then you enter execute twice and this gives you the value that we are after so 21.03 now once you've got the uh, final answer then you write a sentence uh, in context so in this case the median length of the advertisement is about 21.03 seconds hope this makes sense i'd suggest you can pause the video and uh, do this yourself um using equation solver is pretty straightforward uh, but you will need to be careful when you are writing the equation you need to use x theta t function to denote the unknown variable x and uh, you should be able to get the right answer thanks for watching i will see you guys in the next video